Now, unfortunately, this is still very slow to start up, but um, I'll probably fix that. There's also a few graphical issues that I need to fix. It's some very obscure GPU bug in the video. Kind of annoying. But yeah, I'm just going to get this, um, we'll just wait and this will take a while to start up because it takes ages to start up right now. But it will hopefully get better. <laughs> And this is actually, um, it actually sets the clock speed to 444 megahertz when it starts up. So, um, yeah, it's even in the best case, like running as fast as it can. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Let's we'll see in a sec. It, should, it takes about a minute to start, it's kind of annoying. Oh, here we go. So, um, this is RPG Maker XP running on the PS Vita. So this specifically is, um, the Wario Cats game. Um, it was basically the first game I could think of that was made in RPG Maker XP, because it was actually my, the first RPG Maker XP game I ever played. Um, and it's based off of the, the series of books. So I don't actually read anything I know anything about, but my sister is very much into them. Um, so, um, let's see here, we can, I got the audio to work on, um, I got the MIDI audio to work, and I got the sound effects working. So, um, we'll click X, X is mapped to the enter, so L, o is mapped to the, um, escape key. And so I'll click X on the continue. Alright, I'm going to save the save menu. Alright, and we'll go, we'll go to save. Alright, and you see here, we're in the game now. Um, we can play it, you know. Um, now there are a few graphical issues, right? Obviously we'll here, we'll never be a real Wario, right? But if I open up another message box after that, it will it will like, have that stored there. But you'll see the battle system here. This works for the most part. I mean, there's like, some icons are broken, but for the most part, it works. We'll see some of those numbers um, as they're drawn a bit broken. Again, this is, this is some very obscure GPU bug that, um, yeah, I need to, I need to work that out. Um. Right, but you see, it seems to work. But you see how, this is what I'm talking about, about some bug GPU bugs. Um, it's a kind of, sort of draws text, but it has the old text sold out. Yeah, so it makes it almost impossible to read these dialogues. But, you know, um, open up my menu, and you'll see here, the PA time counter is kind of broken as well. Um, and depending on, <laughs> depending on when you turn on your PSV though, sometimes, alright, so this is another weird bug, sometimes when you start it up, the moves button will crash the game, as here it just did. Um, other times it won't, it's, it's probably some weird memory corruption bug I'll need to figure out. But yeah, as you can see, it kind of works, right? Uh, you can kind of play RPG Maker XP on Vito. Um, so yeah. This is accomplished using a open source reverse engineering of the RPG Maker engines called MKXP. It runs the RPG, it runs, um, RPG Maker XP, VX, and VX Ace. However, VX and VX Ace are not working on Vito yet. Um, <laughs> neither is XP really, but it's, it, it works the best. Um, so yeah, and you see this icon here is obviously the default RPG Maker XP icon. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm pointing RPG Maker XP to Vito. So, yeah. <laughs>